Israel. Yes, from me, I think I need that calm, shy, little beast, and little bird, or charging him for a feature. Uh, who's charging who for a feature? Ain't that's how business go? You know what I'm saying? If you want to get on my track, you know what I'm saying? I, I charge you this much. What, they supposed to do features for free? I don't know. No, no. <laughs> Let's see. Go ahead and read. Pepper Shy will be put to Instagram stories to call out Lil Weaver, which I ran for a feature on a song that has very little. I even do a social. So if you see nothing, you see my MSG. Nigga, fuck you. Look. Who? Lizzie. Um. Jack Lizzie wrote that, uh, in the first several posts that he posted about uh, Lil So, did they. Wait a minute, I'm, I'm gonna put it like this. Did they do the music yet? Or they was talking about doing the music? Um, we don't talk about that. Hmm. Oh, no, they didn't do it yet. No, they didn't do it yet. So they was talking about doing it. Um, that's the thing. So they were saying this, I can let that go. I don't say that they were doing it. That they're done. So Shy Glizzy, well, I guess Little Uzi Vert, said that he's charging Shy Glizzy to do a feature. Okay, go ahead. Already got Rock Nation reaching out, talking about a check after this song already out. I spoke to you at Little Ass directly. Um, Little Me on for me on Little Ass. Already Got Rock Nation reaching out, talking about a check after the song already out. And I spoke to your little ass directly. That's funny stuff at. Wait a minute, wait a minute, hold up, hold up. So you says Rock Nation is asking for a. I'm, I'm, this is confusing me here. Okay. So they must have did the track already. Mm. And. Yeah, I think he did a track already, so now um, people are trying to, you know, because they heard the track, they think it's good, but now they're trying to pull it. Like, uh, you, you, gotta, you understand what that is? Nah, you can understand what that is, what's your that? Okay, so, who's looking for a check? Rock Nation, Lil Uzi, or um, this guy here, Shaq Glizzy? Shaq Glizzy. They should have. Shy Glizzy. Um, yeah, go ahead. It says, uh, got Rock Nation reaching out, talking about a check after the song already out. So, Rock Nation's talking about a check for the song that it's already out. Shy Glizzy for that. Why is Rock Nation asking for a check? Rock Nation is a company, ain't it? I mean, um, not fucking. I meant, the whole time I said Shy Glizzy, I meant, um, Lil Uzi Vert. Oh, Lil, Lil, so Lil Uzi Vert is asking for a check after the song is out. He's not asking about it. He says, uh, Rock Nation, um, talking about a check. Like, giving him a check. That's what he means. Not him giving a check to him. But they're giving him a check. You know, you you know why you know why this is confusing, because before 
these two before Shy Glizzy and Little Uzi Vert go into the studio, it should have been already negotiated. Well, who's getting what? Yeah, who's getting exactly. You know what I'm saying? But, um, there was no studio. Remember, the article headline says, Shy Glizzy slams Little Uzi Vert for charges. I mean, I don't know, we don't know if he, um, we don't know if uh, Shy Glizzy took that charge because uh, Little Uzi Vert, um, charged him to be a feature on it. Oh. Who does that shit? I gotta Ni a little bit more. Yeah, cause niggas don't do that shit. You know what I'm saying? If I'm gonna get on a feature, if I'm gonna get on a feature, nigga, listen, either you gonna give me some of your budget, or you know what I'm saying, and all that's on paperwork, so that's in yeah, documentation. Uh, way, the, um, the song should make enough money for each one to get a cut. Yeah, and, and you don't go after each other, you go after the label. Which pays both of you. You know what I'm saying? So by these two beefing over a damn check. That's irrelevant. That's bullshit. Because they beefing back and forth. Ain't nobody going after the label which cuts the checks. So this should tell you that. This seems like to me. It sounds like some type of publicity stunt in itself. But go ahead, brother. Mm -hmm. Um, so that's some fuck ass shit. And then you can't even hit me back to tell me yourself. Niggas be weird as shit. I ain't never paid for a person I like for. You continue for years. Niggas been blackmailing me. And I don't say shit. 95% of the rap niggas I fuck with wish that fuck niggas think they colder than me or some niggas or some. Yo, why do, they, why do my people think so ignorantly? Why are they even talking like this? I mean, Little Uzi Camp should have got with Shy Glizzy's camp. They could have came, they supposed to came together. Contracts would have been signed. Everything would have been negotiated on who gets what. And then the record label is the one that, you know what I'm saying, issues out the check. Everything get, oh, yeah. is, everything is done, everything is done electronically. This is not back in the 80s where, you know what I'm saying, the uh, people pay each other cash up front. Everything is done electronically. Like, 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 say Shy Glizzy do a show at the garden or something like that. Before Shy Glizzy can go and do a show at the garden, all his money is automatically funded into his account. Or half of it. So that, that's why, this, that's why I don't understand. Actually, I think it will be all his money because I'm pretty, who, uh, like when people, when, uh, um, they have like, uh, tours and stuff, like concerts and stuff like that, who thinks that, the, um, yeah. or it comes out of their paycheck. The, the, um, the, the, the promoter of the venue. You know what I'm saying? For all the tickets that's being sold, you know what I'm saying? What not. You know what I'm saying? The artist money get, everything get electronically deposited in everybody's account. The promoters get paid. You know what I'm saying? It ain't really, they ain't really with dealing with no damn, damn cash like that. Unless you are a small time artist and you, you are booking these shows yourself. But these ain't no small time artists and they're not booking shows themselves. They got management teams. So by so by them fighting each other over who's featuring and what, that don't make sense. Because y'all should have been paid. But go ahead, Brother Israel. Yes, sir. Continuing on with Mr. Shite. Oh. Oh, wait, no, you didn't. Let me finish up, okay? Well, actually, you did let me finish. I just stopped to say a comment because you know if I'm not to speak. Oh, okay. But you think they cool at me or something? 
niggas from fucking lane with a name. Please don't play with me. And it's up with whoever. Lucy is yet to respond. So, uh, Shy Glizzy is not on that feature. Because he don't pay for those. So, Shy Glizzy is not on the little Uzi verse feature? Is, he don't, he don't pay for verses, boy. is this just to promote Little Uzi's song? It might be. This is to promote Little Uzi's song. Yeah, because there's like no real beef or anything. Because, no yeah. Between these two, so it can be quiet. Yeah, because it's if... Honest, whether Sh- if Shy Because it's not, it's not up to Shy Glizzy. It's up to who's behind Shy Glizzy. If the contract is signed, he's doing the feature. If the contract is not signed, he's not doing the feature. You know what I'm saying? This is I think this is just yeah, to promote. I think this is just to promote, you know what I'm saying? The the little little Uzi's damn little track and shit. You know what I'm saying? That that's what this is. Yeah, that's exactly what this is. Anyway. Um, like mm-hmm. I said, there's no, um, there's not even a back and forth. It's really just one person is speaking, and that's Shy Glizzy. So, whose track is it? Shy Glizzy's track or Uzi's track? It's little Uzi's track. And Shy Glizzy said he's not on it because Uzi don't want to pay? No. Uzi says. Shy Glizzy is on it because Shy Glizzy is the thing for a verse. I don't. They they're making it confusing, but you know what I'm saying. This look like it's just to promote somebody's track. Anyway, I want to thank you all for tuning in and logging on to another episode of Illuminati News Hour right here on Gospel Talk Radio. I'm your host. I'm your pastor, Mr. Michael Smith. And my co-host is Brother Lamig Israel. If you're new to this channel, please tap that subscribe button. Hit that like button if you like this show. Hit that hate button if you hate this show. Hit that comment or leave a question or comment on this show. Till next time, stay tuned. God bless you.